started out webcamming exclusively on a different cam site. And I was doing that while I was still going to university and it kind of just slowly progressed to a point where I was like, oh, maybe I should try doing, you know what I mean, a video or two and see kind of how that goes. And through trial and error and consistency of putting out videos you know, frequently enough, I realized you know, I, mean, I could make a, I can make bank I could make a business out of this. I was pushing grocery carts as a job and then slowly I would finish my shifts and I'd come over to his house and then I got into the... We started making videos bit, together. And started doing yeah. videos and then I branched off onto my own profile as well and then we both kind of just went from there. I think a lot of people also assume that we go to the bar a lot or we're big clubbers or you know we get that a lot. They're like, oh you must be or we're very promiscuous. That's another common misconception. They think that just because we're in porn that we're out doing it and they're asking us, how do you guys just do just all that? You're, people in you're meeting all these people all the time and really just be farther from the truth. Maybe that like the like drugs are involved and that could be a big part of the gay community and that could be also farther from the truth. Go and try it. And people will be responsive. There's a niche for everybody. We're definitely figures to a lot of people, so it's nice to make that personal connection when people come up to you and actually, you know what I mean, give you a hug, shake your hand, know that you're not just a piece of meat on the camera, right? Porn is a really, it's an avenue you can take and you can be successful and you don't have to feel bad about it, you can feel great about it.